Cool, they are linked in friends. So you know, I'm talking about ethical persuasion. I always tell my clients that it's not your company, it's not your products that are selling. People don't buy your company, they don't buy your products, they buy you. You are the one who does the sale. You are the one who does the persuading because it's a human action to do persuasion. It's a human action to go buy something, you know? That's why testimonials are so important. That's why uh, talking to people is important. That's why seeing people is important. Even when you do online, people want to see testimonials. And when they want to see a testimonial, they want to see a face close to that testimonial because that's what has the value. So why am I talking about all this? Because I, this morning I, I went to a local car dealership because I had to get a, a little two euro part fixed on my car. And while I was w waiting for the, 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 what, the, the garage chef, so to say, uh, he was talking uh, with one of the sales guys. And he goes to the sales guy with a little sheet of paper and says, okay, that lady is ready to buy her car at another dealership, at another brand. But she loves so much the service we give her here in the garage that uh, this is what you should sell her. This is precisely the... She told me what she will get by the other brand and this is what we should give her. So try to make the sale. And then, well, I mean, he's the boss of all the mechanics, right? And my little two-year-old part, he took the time to go put it on my car at no charge. And I thanked him. I asked him if I, if I owe him something. He said, yeah, if you could please stay your client. So that guy who is not the sales guy is doing the best job I've ever seen to grow the sales of this dealership. He's even better than all the sales guy I could see in there who are just walking around, standing around and making faces, you know? So you are the person who sells. If you are, if you are a CEO or a general manager or so on, if you have someone like that in your team, this person is a pure diamond. Don't ever lose that person. This person should teach everyone else how to do things because he is good. He is human. He is smiling. He was really enjoying. Yeah, he's enjoying what he's doing. So you have to keep people like that. So that's it for today, guys. Thank you very much and have a nice weekend.